Dear Bears on Ice fans, I am so happy to see you here on our Boston Bruins New Hour channel. To receive the news faster, subscribe to the channel now. It's simple and fast. This way you will always be informed of the latest news and updates about Bears on Ice. It's game for new Boston Bruins careers for newly acquired Garnet Hathaway and Dmitry Orlov, and so far, so good for the newest members of the Black and Gold Club. It certainly wasn't the highlight in the Boston Bruins' 3-1 win over the Vancouver Canucks that was far more memorable for Linus Olmark's empty net than anything else that happened on the ice. But that's highly appropriate for blue-collar players like Hathaway and Orloff were signed for their solid, all-round games rather than anything that pops on the highlight shows. Before I tell you what they said, click on the like button for this video, as it is essential not to miss the latest Boston Bruins events, posted here, thank you very much. Orloff finished with three shot attempts and a clearance as he went over 20 minutes of ice time, and was on the ice for Vancouver's only goal when he and Derek Forbort left the front of the net open for a quality scoring chance. Coverage seemed to be more with Forbort taking his time getting back into front of net coverage than anything Orloff did or didn't do, so in almost every way it was solid, error-free hockey from both new players. I'm really impressed with Hathaway's detail and penalties and it seems like he already understands our zone D coverage, said Boston Bruins head coach Jim Montgomery. And Dmitry Orloff made some special plays, special passes on escapes, in the neutral zone and in the offensive zone. For a Maine native who played for years at Phillips Andover Academy as a teenager, Hathaway in particular has an understanding of what it means to play for the Boston Bruins and an appreciation for wearing the black and gold. You know, I've talked a lot about the locker room, how welcoming they are, but it's kind of like the whole Bruins nation, the whole Boston area, the whole New England, Hathaway told reporters after the victory in Vancouver. It feels like day one, part of the team and a lot of support. I played for only one team for 11 years, said Orloff. It's a different system, but I appreciate the help of the boys and the coaches. So, it wasn't easy, but it was fun to get the win. It wasn't a fair game but we got the win, so it was good. There are little things that you are not sure about, but you communicate them on ice. You just make simple plays and don't try to do too much. It's a good and special group here. It was a solid start for Orloff and Hathaway, but it's just the beginning of what these two veteran and talented NHL players can bring to a Boston Bruins team that was a wagon before it even got there. And then Bears on Ice fans, in your opinion were these new acquisitions well executed or not? Comment down below your opinion about it. Because it's very important to Bears on Ice what you think. Stay tuned as I update you anytime with the latest news from the Ice Bears.